Alright everybody, I'm excited. I think something really awesome is going to happen in this video. If you've been watching this video walkthrough, the past four or so videos have been kind of boring. Not much has happened. It's sort of like in the first Professor Layton game. I forget which chapter it is. Chapter 3 or Chapter 4, where it's nighttime, and all you're supposed to do is wander around and talk to people and solve puzzles. There aren't any real plot developments or interesting characters. It's all just wandering around and talking to people and solving puzzles. And it was only at the very end of that section that something interesting happened, and you saw the cutscene with the guy carrying the dead body out of town. So I think the same thing is happening here in this game. I think we've reached the point where we finish talking to people, and something interesting is going to happen. And the solution to this puzzle is basically it's the letter A, and we have the mirror version of the letter A right next to it. You can see the pattern, right? A, B, C, D, E, and F. So that's your solution. Let's see if this works. Layton's Apprentice strikes again! So right now in this game, our heroes are looking for pieces to a photograph, and I'm pretty sure that once they get all of the pieces, we have to put them together and we find out the mystery of the diary, we find out something which is really important, something which is awesome, and it will lead us to the castle with the vampire. So I'm really excited because I'm hoping this is going to happen by the end of this video. But first I'm going to solve both of the puzzles here in the alleyway. Puzzle number 83, Pancake Stacks 2. Alright, so this is basically the same as the other puzzle where you move pancakes. You can't put a larger pancake on top of a smaller one. And you do it like this. Here I set up the three in the middle plate, and now I move the large one over there. Do, 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 do. Now I move this one over there. And there we go. This should do the trick. And there we have it. And it appears that I solved this puzzle as quickly as possible. Alright. Now, in the previous video, I went through the northeast alley, and I picked up all six pieces of the photograph there. So now we just need to find all of the other pieces of the photograph, which are going to be scattered all over the town. And I think this guy has one of the pieces. Well, that is interesting news. So Mr. Beluga owns the museum, which is rumored to hold the Elysian Box. Alrighty, eight more pieces of the photo to go. And we want to head to the left, right? Aw oh, man, do we really have 
have to go all over town? Oh, and we have a puzzle. Okay. Puzzle number 112, turn on the light. Okay, so we need to make connections on the diagram to turn on the light. Now, no matter what you do with A, B, and C, the light is going to be on. So what is the fewest number of connections you can make to turn on the light? This is the connection you make. And now to test my theory. A true gentleman leaves no puzzle unsolved. See, it's tricky because you think you have to make connections between A and B and C. And that would work, however, it's easier just to make connections from the battery to the light bulb. Alright, so we got through that puzzle. However, I'm not sure if we can find all of the puzzle pieces by the end of the video. We have seven more to go, and we're about seven minutes into this video. Let's see if we can find them all. Ooh, there's one. Okay, that's good. Six more to go. Six more to go. There's one here. Five more to go. Okay, we might be able to make it by the end of the video. I don't think there's one over here. Oh, we just came from this area. Alright, four more to go. Is there one near Granny Riddleton? We found a hint coin, but I don't see any piece of the photograph. Okay, we just came from here. Doesn't look like we can go inside the cabaret. And this is a new character, so this character obviously has a puzzle. Alright! Okay, so we solve this puzzle, and we get a piece of the photograph. Sounds like a fair trade to me. Puzzle number 101, Disappearing Act 1. Ah, this is Chinese Checkers. I think that's the name of this game, Chinese Checkers. I could be wrong. Anyway, you want to get rid of all the spaces on the board. Ah, man, I'm stuck. Okay, so you want to get rid of all of them except for one. Ooh, and I got stuck again. Hmm. Wow, I can't figure this out. Um... Doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, here we go. Okay. This is the solution. This should do the trick. Ha! Huh, wonderful! Oh, the name of the game is Peg Solitaire, not Chinese Checkers. My mistake.
Yes, everybody left the town because of the evil vampire. Three pieces of photo to go. Let me see, I need to go down. pieces left. Two pieces left. We are totally going to solve it. Yes! One piece left. One piece left. One more to go. One more to go. Bottom part of town. Right? Right? R wrong. Wrong. Maybe he has it. By the gate to the forest. 